This is such a powerful insight to understand, but let me expand on it for you so that I can help. Did you notice how I said masculine and feminine, not men and women? So I want you to take notice of that because it's important to recognize that we need both of these elements, both masculine and feminine qualities, both comfort and tension for each gender. We just need them in different degrees and different ways. And tension is not a bad thing. Similarly to stress, there are healthy elements and unhealthy elements. Just like comfort, you don't want too much of either tension or comfort. And that's exactly why the masculine and the feminine are complementary. They exist in tandem. Both men and women need masculinity and femininity. But if you want to dig deeper on this concept, look at my pinned carousel post on the three shocking truths of masculinity and femininity. I go into it in detail. Hope this was helpful. Thanks for watching.